50 dating trigger women all over the internet the reason why i think so many women on the internet are triggered by the idea of going 50 50 is because we realize it's not a good deal and men know it's not a good deal so the 50 50 thing comes up every now and then but i want to add a new twist to the argument just stop don't do it in the west instead do this now that we have the Passport Brothers movement and Save Yourself Black Man, do we really still need to do the 50-50 thing with a bunch of ungrateful women in the West? We're not trying to date any of the women in the West. So here's the better ideal. I think it would be better if we get our passports and don't do the 50-50 thing at all. I think it would be better if... Brothers went overseas and just paid for everything. You will have a much more grateful woman overseas than you would in the States or in the West. 50-50 should be used for two people getting together and helping make their finances meet from month to month. But most of the women in the West, they don't want that. They want you to pay all for the most part. Let's say if you're in the West and you pay for everything, what would you get out of paying for all the bills with an ungrateful woman? Nothing. There is no value there. You would pay all the bills and you would still probably have to come home to cook, clean, or who knows, you'd be in a sexless marriage or whatever the case may be. So at least if you go overseas, and you pay for everything, you're getting quality. In the West, you're not going to get quality. So in this case, brothers, the best thing I can suggest to you is just leave the women alone in the West. Um, leave them to their own devices, whatever it may be. And your best bet at this point is if you're thinking about becoming a passport brother or if you're thinking about doing Save Yourself Black Man, I would try to work, save my money, and make some sort of escape plan. And if you can't make an escape plan, find communities that are still traditional in America or in the West. See if you can try to date some of their women if you can't get a passport and go overseas. Or you could deal with women like this. I'm just wondering how men who want 50-50 relationship and baby as well. How do you think that woman can trust you that you will take care of her during the pregnancy if you don't even want to pay for her dinner? All right, folks, this, this is the part where I ask you to please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. And if you want to support my channel, I will put a buy me a coffee link in the description. Just keep in mind, brothers, that you cannot do the 50-50 thing overseas. When you go overseas, you're going to have to pay for 100% of the bills and everything else. But you get something in return. You're going to get a house that is clean. You're going to get meals that are cooked and other things. But on that note, I'm Andre Brooks, your favorite incel, and I'll see you on the next video. I know a lot of women going to be against this. They think the man should take over the load, but I think different. 40, 50, 60, I some years ago, maybe 70, y'all fought for women's rights. Y'all did all that, fought for women's rights. Y'all got y'all rights, and now y'all want to control the narrative and tell us what we should do and tell us how we should handle the uh, household and things of that nature. No. Y'all wanted women's rights. Y'all wanted to work. Y'all wanted to do all that. Y'all going 50-50 on these bills. Y'all going 50-50 on this household regardless. I don't want to hear it. Can't no woman jump in a relationship with me and think it's not going to be 50-50. I'm not handling the load. It's either 90-10, it's either you, or it's going to be 50-50. We do it together. Nothing gets fairer than that. That's that's fully fair. I don't, I don't see what's the problem with that. Women want you to do everything. Pay the bill. They want you to be able to lay it down in bed. They want you to be able to fix everything. They want you to prote want you to protect the household. Do that leave any room for us to just be us and do what we want to do? No. Y'all want us to do everything. And what y'all going to do? What do y'all expect y'all supposed to be doing? Nothing. Oh, I take care of the kids, the household. I do this. Half of y'all don't clean up. Half of y'all don't cook. 
Majority of y'all don't clean up. Majority of y'all don't cook. Y'all don't do nothing. Y'all ain't handy. What is you bringing to the table? Well, let me guess. Born old saints. We, we can get that anywhere nowadays. It's, it's, it's too easy. Access is everywhere. We, we need more than that. You got to bring way more to the table than that. You feel me? How about y'all take care of us? Staying home, doing household things, that's easy. For me and like me, that's easy. Let a woman take care of me. Food gonna be done, house gonna be clean, kids gonna be on the schedule. In bed when you get home, I'm gonna rub your feet, I'm gonna eat your body alive, everything. Life ain't fair, man. And y'all making it worse. It's hard for a man out here, man. Especially a black man.